Thanks so much, Kathleen and John. When the Hokies take the field tomorrow in the Pinstripe Bowl, it'll be bringing back some memories of when the Yankees helped Virginia Tech after the tragic school shooting in 2007 that claimed 32 lives. WFXR Sports' David Guzman reports on the special connection between Blacksburg and the Bronx Bombers. Well, remember this week began with Virginia Tech visiting the 9-11 Memorial and Museum, getting perspective on one of the nation's darkest days. But in 2008, it was the Yankees helping the Hokies out in the wake of one of the school's toughest times, a baseball game, a simple gesture, linking forever Blacksburg with New York. It's hard to really ever forget. I can say for myself, having been on campus in 07, and the starting pitcher a year later in 08. It's a common conversation for me and uh, it's hard, uh, but I appreciate it because it kind of helps speak to, for me, the definition of being a Hokie. In the aftermath of the Virginia Tech school shooting that claimed 32 lives, Andrew Wells knew that baseball would be part of the healing process. Uh, we kind of felt like we were part of that catalyst, part of that movement to bring the community together, to bring campus together, to provide everyone kind of a distraction. But it was the New York Yankees that lent a hand when Blacksburg needed it the most. Steinbrenner, as we learned, had reached out to our athletics department again pretty quickly and said, hey, we want to be a part of the healing process. Uh, we're going to send our guys to play your guys. It's really hard to explain what it meant to me. Um, but I recognized then, and I can fully appreciate now, it wasn't about me. It wasn't about our, our baseball program. Um, it was about this campus, this community. Less than a year after that dark day, the Yankees made the trip to the New River Valley to visit the April 16 Memorial and play an exhibition against the Virginia Tech baseball team at English Field. Yankees. I'll never forget towing that rubber. I put my head down, and as I looked up, it was me and Johnny Damon, head to head. Wells, a left-handed pitcher, made the start of a lifetime that no other Hokie had ever done before. I faced in order uh, Damon, Jeter, Abreu, A-Rod, and Giambi, and uh, I gave up one under and run. So I left the mound that day feeling pretty good. I felt like I had pitched 20 innings walking off after that one inning of work. The Yankees went on to win the seven inning contest 11 nothing, but everyone knew the day had very little to do with baseball. It was for the 32 and it was for the Hokies that we lost and for the tragic events that had taken place a year prior and uh, just an incredible gesture on behalf of the Yankees. That was the start of the Hokies Yankees bond because they did step up in a way that no one could have imagined. That day changed my life forever. Forever will be a Yankees fan. In honor of what the Yankees have done for Virginia Tech over the years, the Hokies will be wearing the New York Yankees logo on a side of the helmets that they'll be wearing tomorrow at the Pinstripe Bowl. A neat gesture from the Hokies to say thank you to the New York Yankees. Local from Yankee Stadium in the Bronx, David DeGuzman, WFXR Sports. Thank you so much, David. And later in sports, we'll get a final preview from David on tomorrow's Pinstripe Bowl. We'll have more WFXR News first at 10 after this break.